Welcome back, everyone. We're here at CEO 2018 Daytona Beach, Florida, mm -hmm. and we're back with more Tekken World Tour Master Event action. We've had right. quite the the matches so far, and we're not even close to what is going to be like you no. know the crazy stuff. We're yeah. whittling down, of course, today to our top eight, and then of course we'll have our top eight tomorrow. So I'm here with Rip. Rip, how you mm -hmm. doing? I'm doing great. Right now it is 1 p.m. Uh, we have five more hours of pools before we get to our top 48. Yeah. So we are going to be winding down for a long time here today. Uh, all these players, of course, trying to make it out of the pools. Two players make it out of the winner side of each bracket. One player out of the loser side of the bracket. Yeah, so we have the three out four match, which has been really, I think, the first time it's really been used throughout the Tekken World Tour. We've had it done at several of the events so far uh, yeah. this year. All right, I'm excited to see this. So we have Broken Alliance uh, Reflex. Reflex going up against Jace. And uh, I feel like we saw this match earlier. Was it? Do we see Law and Kazumi? Uh, this match? Oh, we saw these characters earlier. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I mean, Reflex, he's a very good law player. I believe he's from Florida. So he's, uh, I feel like, you know, hometown. law players are like a, a family. You guys always talk to each other the in your street chat. The majority of us. Yeah, are, you guys are, well, okay, yeah. True, true. I know where you're getting at. <laughs> Damn, it's crazy how we, we click on like a, a millisecond <laughs> of, uh, of chat. Anyways, let's see how uh, this one turns out. Oh, a nice attempt there. Counter it for. Do you like this matchup? I feel like, you know, this is a very, very tough matchup for Law just because, you know, uh, one of his better, you know, ranged tools is not as good as it used to be his standing four. It doesn't really mm. play a factor in yeah, the matchup. And, you know, it's really annoying versus her because her counter four is so good. But beautiful. Here's the launch from Jace. I think the matchup is uh, difficult, but honestly, I think she has a lot of punches, right? Like, a lot of her attacks aren't kicked, so yeah. I, I treat her kind of like Steve. Oh, I see. Okay. Yeah, I, f I feel like she has maybe a bit more utility than Steve, just because she Way can more. easily, she can easily, you know, combo, get into a juggle, mm -hmm. right? Yeah, you know, the running twos, the fly mix-ups, it's uh, hard to deal with, but he's gonna get a wall spot here. Rage Art, oh man, I don't think it's gonna kill. It's gonna be close. I'll say, I'll say no. Damn! What the? <laughs> we both lost? <laughs> Wait, what happened? I said, I don't know. I feel like I was closer to winning. You said no. <laughs> You're right. I feel like you, be by you saying that, Forced me to say no. <laughs> I blame James Baited. Chen. God damn it. Did you see that clip with James Chen F word? When no. they were doing each other's commentary? Really? It was good. Oh, okay. it was pretty good. Because it's like the guy's like neutral jumps and then uh, get the land, hit in the air, and F word's like, is it gonna kill? <laughs> <laughs> it's so funny. We should try that. I, 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 could, I, I could do Steve easy. Oh, Steve? I could do Steve. Steve is, well, anyone can do Steve. And I could oh, do the Aris. I could, I could say random stuff. Mm -hmm. It'll be easy. Damn, you should be Eris and I'll be Steve. <laughs> I gotta, I gotta put like a, a weird pipe in my throat. Oh, I'm gonna do Eris. <laughs> Gross! Get well, yeah. that out of your throat, uh, man. Yeah, I need to, I need to get lung cancer real quick. But I can do Eris. Oh boy! Give me Down, some. Down two, three. Give me some me medicinals. <laughs> medicinals. Medicinals. Wow, reflex. Oh. Down two, three to close see, out. See, it's always Confidence. a bad sign when we look into the crowd and we see a player. That means they're up soon. Mm -hmm. I saw JDCR in the crowd. It's probably a worse sign for whoever's sitting next to him. Is that oh. Ace Unlimited? Uh, yeah, but Ace, Ace, Ace is playing so... Oh, wait, yeah, there. It might cool. be Ace versus JDCR. Yeah, okay. That's a potential yeah, matchup, is in maybe. there? I see Yu is in the crowd as well. Mm -hmm. huh, all right, all right. I heard uh, Yu's pool is pretty hard, actually. I, I, I'm pretty sure I every pool... I thought she's a pool. Oh, yeah, Majin. That's another X Factor in mm -hmm. this tournament because Huge. he doesn't really travel or he hasn't traveled that much. Well, last time we saw it was E League. Oh my gosh, that was forever ago. That was yeah. back in March. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. It's been a quarter of a year since we've last seen a little mod wow. competing. But here we go, game number two. Reflex, look at in control of the matchup. Oh my gosh, 4 4 2 1. Interesting choice there. No ducks on the highs. But man, all right, he's tied to me right a lot. Oh my god, that was a sick back three. Another one, look for the wall splat. The one thing he's not doing, he wasn't really sidestepping with her, so he kind of just let her out of the wall. Pressure now, the one, two, three uh -oh. count rating. Jeez. Look at that, the one, two, three rush. It's been working out. Again, you're right. Boom! Oh. Maybe that's his thing. Maybe he's trying to figure out. He's trying to build the offense and uh, you know the reactions from the one, two, three. It's been working out so far. Okay, wow. nice block. I mean, that's so hard yeah. to see. That could not have been a purpose, yeah. right? It's, you know, <laughs> it's not worth it either. Because I mean, wow. you think about it. 
the damage on that down back two is like it's like almost nothing. Didn't go for it. Yeah, okay. side wall splat. You know, you have to do, I mean, I was talking to Jimmy J last night actually about what Law's best options for side wall combos are. And he said like he's seen the regular wall combo hit uh, on a side wall. But I, and I've seen that too. I just don't know what the, the rules are about it, right? And he says he thinks what it is is you just have to do the DSS as fast as possible, like a perfect I see, DSS. I see. Because yeah, you have a lot of time. Yeah. I mean, normally you have a lot of time. And he said that you gotta pretend like it's Tekken Six when you're doing the wall combo. Oh man. So I tried it. I got it hit once. So he might be onto something there. Oh my goodness! Run up rage art. Usually from a side wall spin though, you could do the the full shallow spin kicks. You could do the four three four, three, four right? Uh, from a side. It depends on which side of the wall. Oh, you're I on. see. Okay. Man, again, starting to use that one, two, three. Man, I just realized Reflex is such a jerk. He ran up there to bait out a getup kick for his rage art at the end of the last yeah, round. Yeah, he was trying to. He's trying to style on mm -hmm. him. That's why. Okay. Nice, going for the low this time. Strike starting to whittle away at Jace here. While well, standing one hits, has him at the wall. This is good. Oh, wow. he oh, tried to counter. He confirmed that dirty and stuff. And no hop kick punish from Jace. Just letting him get away with the dirty stuff. And man, he's just rushing down back fours, down back threes, and back four three. Didn't even hit him. He's like, you know what? I'm sure it'll work this time. Reflex. Gonna advance over Jace. You're at CEO Daytona. Yeah. 2018. And again, if you guys are tuning in right now, you're watching the Tekken World Tour. This is a master event brought to you by Twitch, Bandai Namco Entertainment, and of course our sponsors, Quanba, for their beautiful arcade sticks and uh, accessories as well. I wonder what match we're going to have up next. I'm kind of excited to see because, you know, we were talking about we have that that really strong oh, player out yeah. in the crowd. They're both standing. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. So it's Ace Unlimited going up against Echo Fox, JDCR. And of course, JDCR coming off is, you know, Somewhat of a bad performance, you know, when he lost. Oh, it's to... definitely bad. Anytime he doesn't make top eight, it's bad. Right. It's uh, like unexpected. And Ace Unlimited at that same event, I believe, took out Kakoma. Yeah. And when I asked With him. With uh, Eliza, right? Did he use Eliza? I don't recall. But when I asked him, you know, how did he beat Kakoma, he said, well, the thing about it is, I have the internet. And there's a lot of matches. I just studied all the matches. So I'm curious, did he study all the JDCR matches? Because there's a well, ton of those online. You think about you. it. The theory should be the same, right? Yeah. Like, there are more JDCR matches than anything else out there, I think. Mm -hmm. But the problem is with JDCR is I don't think he plays in a way where you can really download his style. I mean, maybe, man. I don't, I don't know what Unless Ace's, you pick Paul Phoenix. I don't know what Ace Unlimited's read is, right? All well, I know what is, is download cannot, technology. All I know is, is it, Ace Unlimited can't let you into hook this at all. Well, he doesn't need it. Maybe he's going to use, like, uh, Oscar. What did he use before? Was it Jun? Jun? It, I, I feel like it was Jun and Oscar, right? I don't remember. I think it was Asuka and Jin. Maybe. Man, look at the, the Tattoo mind game. was a while ago. Oh, well, here we go. No need for Electric Wind Hookman. Echo Fox team manager walking over Boken. He's like, JDCR, you need water? You already got water. All right, I'm good. I'm going to sit down. You need a massage? Look at Ace Unlimited. He's reading the notes. What did I study last night? He's like, oh, no, I can't connect to my notes. <laughs> Fuck the cloud. Oh, <laughs> not cloud. Bad reception. That's actually one of the worst things I hate is, like, when you go to an event or a convention and uh, just the, the cell reception is horrible. Yeah. Too many devices. In our hotel? Oh, man, I was about to take some top secret strat. I'm going to tell you later. Oh. Oh, all right. Because I just realized we're on stream. I don't want everyone to do my secret strat. That's how I right. got good internet speeds. Oh, okay. Well, we'll wait for that later. Anyways, we're going to go right back into the action here. Ace Unlimited versus JDCR starting it off. And we are here in Howard Estate. Jace are unafraid to do that running, too. And, you know, if you're Jin and you parry that, you can, like, can-can. Yeah. You definitely can. And here's hey, a nice hey. back three double combo here. About even on life for both of these players. Did you see the size that point mm -hmm. blank on the Demon Paw? You know, JDCR, maybe he's back. This will be the test, right? Yeah, I feel like we say that every other tournament, and maybe he's back. Maybe. <laughs> even, no, even though he's still the best no, player. Uh, there's no Rocks boys here, huh? No Rocks boys at all. Okay. So those guys are maybe, you know, taking a short hiatus, a little break here. I, I also heard that uh, they saw how much of a travel, t uh, t how much travel time it would take to get to Daytona. Oh, They're yeah. like, I'm good. No thanks. I mean, this was definitely the worst tournament to travel to this year so far, right? Just yeah, in well, terms of all the delays and cancellations that happened. Yeah, I'm not sure about Chanel, but I would say for sure, knee is safe. Oh, yeah. yeah he's got like 1,220 yeah. points I, I, or something. I wouldn't even say safe. I think he's safe until the end of the season. I, th oh, I don't yeah. think he has to play. I think he'll make it no matter what. Yeah, he's qualified. Yeah. Ace and Lewin pretty close here, though. Against JDCR starting off. Nice throw check. Oh, nice. 
He's got those right back at the counter. Eight. Closing Eight it unlimited out. Unlimited. Maybe the board. he did study the tapes. I hope he did, because I really want to see a close and tight matchup between these two. Man, down back fours and cats up the back two one. All right. And you know, Run of Black even with regular Jin has had pretty decent success against JDCR. And a, the key to beating a lot of these Korean players has been winning the first game. Yeah. If and you lose kinda... the first game, you're kind of done. But look at this, Ace Unlimited, two to one round lead. Yeah, game that one. was a, a huge life lead in that, in, mm -hmm. that, in that third round. Yeah, the down back fours have really been working out. Beautiful, like I said. Oh my God. Well, that's the thing, you know, he's starting to move now. He's starting to show Ace Unlimited that he, he, his spacing is like, you know, oh, JDCR boy. is known for his spacing. What? Uh oh, uh oh, two throw. Wow, good oh. break. Man, this is this is kind of tense. Just, you know, just seeing how this is playing out. <gasps> Dude, he's looking he to tie it up. There he gets it. Final Beautiful. round here, match number one. Beautiful adaptation. All the down back forwards that he was doing have been nullified now. And now JHR answering back to the zone, but here comes the LLRK. Yeah, the low, uh, low, <laughs> low lunging, lunging low roundhouse kick. kick. Oh, something like right that. roundhouse kick or whatever. No, no, probably. I'll go with the round now. Man, it's gonna be a close end of the round here for this first game. Oh man, this, this is a lot closer than I thought it would be. Here you go, poke it away and again. Oh, the way he's that. What are you crazy? He's JDCR. He's all right. He's all right. Side wall stun. Never mind. He's, he's not going to JDCR. <laughs> oh, he if that was running too, though, he would have had the can can for the win. He was yeah. saving it. He was saving for the end. I like the idea. Oh my. What are you gonna do? Cancel? Yeah, to nothing. All right. Would. Oh. Last pick. Oh, oh my I can't God. believe it reached. He has no rage. Savage though. Sword. Follow up here. One mix up could do it. Oh, oh, I can't believe he went for it. On the Oki? God. Man, that was, that was, such re a big that was really close. But also such a good risk. Ace Unlimited down to the wire. I, for respect, game one. I respect that he tried. For, he yeah. tried. I respect. Man, hasn't he heard? You always go in. Go mid at the end of the round. Boy, oh boy. Oh, man. He could have had that. He definitely could have. Round Chihuahua. Rough. All right, back into it. Mishima Dojo again? Wait, What's was it? Was Did they rematch? No, they didn't because... Okay. You never know. I'm going to assume that they just... Did they select? 50-50. Yeah. What are the Time odds of getting the stage, stage again? 50-50. Yeah, 50-50. Either yes or no. They weren't even on Mishima Dojo before. They were on Geese the Stage. You're right. I remember. <laughs> the, I was just humming the music. I was like, hey, dojos are dojos, man. Come on, bro. <laughs> they use the same contractor. Wow, I'm losing more LLRKs. Like, you just guessed. And, you know, realistically. Wow. Demon Hop? In a round situation, people are going to duck a lot. Yeah. Oh, they want to. I mean, they want to avoid, you know, what would normally be the, the hit oh, that kills. Oh, boy. In the back. Upside down. With the Reiji, so oh, no! Why would he stay? Why would you stay? Maybe you scared of J Chai to crazy back hole catch. Rage drive in the back, upside down. <laughs> 69 <laughs> position? <laughs> All right, cool. He, he, I didn't know he had a setup like that. He oh my god, look at this, he's doing it again. He's chaining CR. <laughs> okay, here we go, down two. Oh, oh my god. god, he got him. He is stuck in the blender now. I think if I'm Jen, instead of risking the duck, I'm risking the parry. between the down twos and the running twos. Man, the back one was twos now. And this second game is a blow up right now. Ace Unlimited, can you get anything started? Beautiful crowd dash one. If JDCR does it, it's gonna hit. I think his hit ratio on that is probably like 98%. 99. Oh, oh my goodness. After such a, you know, such a tight earlier match, yeah. seeing this is just kind of disheartening. It is, but that's the man himself, JDCR, perhaps returning to form here at CEO Daytona 2018. But don't call it a comeback. He's, he's never lost. He's never lost. He just ran into some some death fist last time. Yeah, he ran into a lot of death fists. Man, coming up next, we've got Trungi. I think, you know. Who's wait, these guys are playing each other? Wow, former teammates. Oh, now Trungi on a team without him. Is that an MTV logo? What is that? Paramount? I don't know. I see. Yeah, it's like a mix of both. Columbia Pictures? I don't know what that is. We'll find out shortly. I, I feel like, you know, Trungi is the dark horse. I mean, the way he plays Geese is like, he's obviously playing Geese at a different level oh, than yeah. uh, most Geese players out there. I think he's made so many top eights this year, I feel like. He, he has. 
and he's beaten a lot of top players. I think he's actually, I'm going to look it up, but I think he's actually one of the top ranked Americans. Oh, yeah? So what is he? He's, he's after Anakin and, what's, and Joey Fury then? Mm, probably. Yeah, I know Speed Kicks fell off a little bit. So yeah. Speed Kicks is Speed not Kicks in the top has not been making, Yeah, he hasn't really been making top eights, which was where you get the majority of the points. Mm -hmm. Is there a search for the players on this thing? I don't know. Yes, the first the first American is Anakin at 12th place. Okay. And then after that, it's Joy Fury at 19th. And then it's Speed Kicks, I believe, at least. Speed Kicks at 20. All right, so I was wrong. Oh, then it's Shadow, and then Trungi. All right, so he's up there. Okay, he's, he's like still, top he's six still... or something in the U.S. How many points does he have? 27. Okay. Oh, no, sorry, 70. What the hell? Okay, that's all. He's ranked at 27th, my bad. Okay, global rank 27. That's crazy. Global American rank, rank 27. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I was Kongi's just, top yeah. five in USA right now. Yeah, but number 27 in the world. Right. That just shows how fierce the competition is. Because there's a lot of European players on that listing as well. Oh, yeah. Europe definitely has more players in the top 20 right now. Tishuan is chilling up there. Pretty I was just in Europe, right? Uh-huh. Enjoying the Poland event. I tried to talk smack about Europe. It's Did you enter to... the tournament? No. Oh, man, that would have been no. so sick. Well, I was like, well, I, I didn't expect to go really far in the tournament if I did enter, but mm -hmm. I mean, I had to do commentary, so I was there the, 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 almost the whole time for commentary. Yeah, that's how I do it, too. <laughs> yeah. That was a long event, huh? In it terms was, of how much commentary? Uh, I, no, it was, you know, it was, it was fine. It just, it was a long event. <laughs> okay. It was a long event. There was a lot more people than they expected, so. Gotcha. So this is a crazy matchup. Trungi versus Cody Vu, formerly both on Virtual Storm. Tennessee, Tennessee. Both Tennessee boys. Yeah, and now Geese Howard versus Kazia. Yeah, so MNT Trungi. I'm not sure what MNT stands mountain. for. Mountain. He's got a mountain on his shirt, yeah, two of them. It makes sense. Boy. Unless it's Monday Night Tekken, I'm not really sure. Whoa. Or something even more crazy. I don't know, let's think of really messed up acronyms. Oh man! Uh, no. Midnight well, train. No, let's let's not. Let's <laughs> is not midnight talk. train the Tekken Six stage? No. Is that what it's called? What is it called? Um, the, the tunnel. The train. On the story mode. Oh, the, that's Nightmare Train. Damn, what's close? Yeah. On uh, no, Devil Within, right? Yeah. 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 Nightmare Train. Cody, first round, wave a wave. It's all warmed up. Good to go. And that's the thing, too. You know, Geese's uh, is uh, forward 1 plus 2 is forward 12. Uh -huh. Sorry, guys. Don't do that to me. <laughs> yeah, it's forward 1 plus 2. That move is so good. I mean, it's safe, right? Everyone knows that it doesn't have the best tracking. Right. And you can kind of hit him out of it if you kind of predict it's coming out. But because that move is safe and it's scary and least to a combo, it makes his low so much better. Mm -hmm. Oh, my God. He went for it. And it down. Oh, my God. Interception. Yeah, ran into it. Rage mode now for Cody. But Trungi tries to go with the down two, doesn't get it. Cody with the low parry. Can he do enough damage to break the wall? Decides to spend none of the rage. Rage drive blocked. And the healthy block, but he doesn't punish well. Oh, I can't what? believe he just landed that and it hit. All right, here we go. Tied up on rounds. All right, interesting start. Oh, oh he, he went tried. for it, yeah. Still He's like, got whatever. I'll get a little conversion. Punish that. His uh, full crouch launch is such a funny notation too, right? For Geese, like full crouch down forward one or something. Oh yeah, from crouch yeah, from crouch down forward one. Oh. Uh -huh. Actually, you know that is Geese's only normal launcher. From crouch down forward one. Um, well, I guess other than forward one plus two. Forward one plus two. Yeah. The the, the jumping oh, swipe. Oh, I see what you're saying. Yeah. Gotcha. He doesn't have that many jungle starters. He has a lot of counter hit starters. Right. And, uh, yeah, and once that required meter. Mode. Yeah, yeah. yeah. What? That was a wild standing two. <laughs> that was a glorious Somehow, demon gun punch. Somehow, 4-4 came out. Oh, my God. Oh, he tried the crazy rewall back combo. Yeah. I've seen those what? jump back ones. Those are crazy. No, he missed it. But Trunk's still in it, though. Spend the meter. Cody, though, trying to close it out. Oh, no, why? What? what? It wasn't. Oh, my God. He hit a button? He hit a button, and he, then he hesitated. Look at the notes. Don't hit that button. Damn it. Yeah. I knew that. Oh, I like the colors on uh, Cody's stick. Purple oh, and cool. green. It's either the Incredible Hulk. Or, oh, yeah. Or the jo Joker. Or mm -hmm. 
uh, Ava Unit Zero One. What's that? Uh, it's from an anime. Okay. Uh, yeah. Is it actually an anime? Or yeah, is it a it's, a, it's anime? a good anime. It's not a special okay. anime. <laughs> yeah, I am a whole, I'm a wholesome kind of guy. I don't know, Plus, Mark. <laughs> I, I only talk about things I know. I don't know any of those special things. <laughs> I don't know any anything about that kind of stuff. But I feel like Tasty Steve might know. Oh yeah. Yeah. He definitely would know. Yeah. Shows beads on his hand. <laughs> 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 oh god! All right, I'm thinking too much now. All right, Duomo de Sirio. It got, it got real Sirio just now. <laughs> yeah, got real Sirio. Yeah. Nice. Gets the combo hey, at the hey. wall. Oh, you try to catch him again. I think these are on purpose, right? We saw Cody just earlier today too. Man, nice sidewall conversion. Man, is Cody Truggy's weakness? But because they're on the same team, they never met up. This is why he got all those points. Oh, it went for it there. Now look at the patience of Cole. Ouch. Maxwell running out. Okay, he went for the fireball. Oh my god. Uh, I like it. Okay. I hate it. That downboard one's so annoying. It is. I mean, <laughs> it's a necessary evil. Oh my god, he caught him right out of the forward one plus two. Gets the follow up. No, doesn't get the. Oh, nice launch. Mm hmm. And he should get the wall here. And one of the great things about Geese is his wall consistency and his wall carry. So good. Okay, testing him here. Down forward one. Into the oh, fireball. Man. Again. Oh, man. Oh, my. It, no, he didn't get the standing two afterwards. No conversion after forward one plus two either. Wow, down forward two. Oh! Just when you thought it was safe to hit some buttons. Hey, I'm In, a Mishima player. Yeah, Boom. into the rage art. Lasers, pew, 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 pew. Got him. And Cody tying it up on rounds here. That was really Trungy's round, too. That could be the moment that turns things around here. Yeah, you, I mean, you really hate that. I mean, you lose, you get launched, and then you realize they have rage, and they're like, oh, no, they're yeah, going to rage. Yeah, I'm dead. Yeah, that's the worst feeling. Or or we could just say it out of nowhere. Is he going to die? Is that going to do enough? <laughs> Is this going to be enough right here? Oh. It could be. Actually, it could if you had enough meter. <laughs> Nice. He went for the tracking move here, the follow-up, and that should be able to close it out here. Oh, yeah. And that's the thing, right? This should have been Trungi's game right there. He should not have lost the last round. Would have been over, off. yeah. It would have been over. But now Cody has another chance. Oh! Whee! That was sick. Double backdash to avoid the forward one plus two on the start of the round. Man, it's a lost art form, I'm telling you, man. Backdash electric wing office is something you don't see yeah. too I, often anymore. And look at the damage you got just from that one launch. Yeah, that's man. all because of that double backdash. Oh, and the, there's the wall setting, too. This is gonna, oh my god. Is he gonna hit the wall? It does, now the mix up. No, the punish! But the wall's right there, not a big damage combo. Nice little uh -huh. berry, that might be it. And here we go, set point for Cody. That round's coming back to Han Trungi right now. Yeah, he could have really used it here. Yeah, to use it, nice. Nice block oh, in the back for mix up. One for the delayed uh, mid there with the wall standing three. Man, he really liked that Tiger Knee Air Fireball. Nice, good stuff there with the down forward one. Able with the brakes on. Max mode running out. He went for it. Pressure. Oh, he ducked the electric, didn't pull the trigger. Oh boy, Cody. What? Nothing. Why is the wall in such a weird position there? Yeah, the wall definitely messed him up there. Man. Sometimes the oh. wall is your best tag tournament partner. Wow, and now Trungi might be sent down to lose a bracket. That round coming oh, back to Hawk. Got Hunt. it. Cody with the Mishima action, able to close it out there with the Hell Sweep to the punch. Unsponsored Cody Boo. Versus the Mountain Man. The Mountain Man, Trungi. If, you were, if your team was actually Mountain Man, who would you want to rep your team? Uh, I'd say Spirogen. Mm, yeah, mountain Man Spirogen? That would be good. I mean, he looks like a mountain kind of guy. Right? I mean, who else looks like a mountain kind of guy? Mateo. Oh, Mateo? Yeah. yeah, he definitely belongs yeah. on Team Mountain. Okay, I need to stop talking. I'm going to make some, some bad jokes. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, guys, we I have more. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I got to go with too. I know what you're thinking. I know exactly what you're thinking, but we can't say that because they end up hey. fighting. Wow, we got a good match coming up, though. We do have a good match coming up. Yeah. Do oh, you want to tell the tell, guys about it? I'll tell it? you guys who it is. It's going to be Reflex <laughs> <laughs> versus p <Pele. laughs> It should be fun. I mean, we'll see how this one turns out. But uh, I don't know. Why does he always wear masks now? Uh, and a My a Hero question. Academia headband. Are you? Do you watch anime? 
I do. Do you I, watch I my hero? I haven't watched that one yet. Oh, it's actually pretty to. good. It's I've easy heard, to catch I've up. Heard a lot easy of to catch up. Yeah. Is it on Hulu? Well, you, you heard a lot of people. It's probably Steve talking about it the whole both time. Both Steves. Oh, both Steves. Yeah. Okay. The, the, the both double Steve's whammy. Plus the uh, Ringe. So a lot of guys are watching that. So I'm going to catch up. Yeah. It's it's not bad. I've been hooked on uh, a bunch of Netflix lately. Like what? The Flash. Ah, CW's The I, Flash. I haven't, I haven't seen that. I got to catch Damn up. Damn show is dick. It's like a kid show, but can't stop watching it. And then I'm also catching the rest of the Marvel stuff there from like, uh, what was that thing called? Jessica Jones, Luke Cage, all uh, that stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All their new seasons came out. Oh, yeah, just the other day, right? Yeah, Luke Cage is very recent. So, catching up on all that. All right, like good citizens, they were able to disconnect all the previous devices, and we're going to get smart into this matchup here. I wonder who Re Reflex is going to pick. Martial Law. You think, you think he's oh, stuck wait, on that? Oh, he's got a geese? I don't know if he has a geese. Does he? If he does, it would be good against Ling. But Law is not terrible against Ling either. The thing is, Feeling has a lot of Law experience. A lot. Yeah. Not just for me. He also uses Law too. Yeah. And even, uh, remember that one time at E3, actually, Speed Kicks tried Law against him, got a game. But at the end, Peeling turned it around on him. Yeah. The Law pick wasn't enough. So, Reflex, though, he is a Law main. He's going to Souk stage. Law is going to have access to those walls. going to be good for him. But also, Ling Xiao, you're going to have access to those walls. Let's see how much Ling experience Reflex has. That's going to be the real test here. Yeah, and I feel like I'm pretty sure these guys have come across each other before in past, in the past. Probably. So I think it's mostly going to be Peeling kind of figuring this out and how, how he wants to take the pace of the matchup. But we'll see. Who knows? He might just be a scumbag. Yeah, Reflex start off things with a side to left back to another good tool against Ling. So he definitely seems like he knows what he's prepared to do in this matchup. That was really interesting, too. He did the Dragon Hammer, did nothing after it. Nice. I noticed these mini sidesteps that Peeling is going for as well. He's trying to create space. Ooh. Obviously, maybe try to bait Reflex to do certain moves. Hey. Counter hit the set. Whoa! Didn't wow. get the crowd cancel. He wanted the crowd cancel, yeah. but when you don't get the crowd cancel, you crowd, you get, you get four up. Yeah, that's an unfortunate wall. He should be able to... Okay. Oh, boy. What? Well, okay, yeah, that's I a mean, nice wall carry, but... That time he didn't need it, it right? Yeah, yeah, he misjudged it. He could have closed it out there for sure. First round reflex, though. This could be good for him. Into the command grab, the follow-up here. Goes for the back turn. Oh, oh set up. And the follow-up here. He has the wall. Mix up. Oh, yeah, reflex didn't have a whip point there. Feeling walking away from the wall. Nice. Position reflexes back to it. Oh, my God. The risky stuff. Firecracker. Yeah, finally went for the low there. Oh, good block. What? Oh, I can't believe that I'm didn't so even hit. That was so sick. What would normally be a guaranteed Michael punish? Murray. I know, maybe he did Rebound. a little slow there, but he I don't know. Do that was slow. crazy. It went through her body. She wasn't even there. What are you talking about, man? She's I in the other point. match right now. He's already up 1 0. <laughs> That's why I whiffed. They're playing in different timelines. Jeez, Louise. Okay. Float? Oh, he oh float I thought he had the that. float. He should have had a follow-up, right? Yeah, standing two with a float there. Counter four. Raccoon swing, follow-up, gets the screw. Now pushing towards the wall. Oh, no. oh my god, that is the right idea. And then he falls to the AOP mid-launcher. Bummer. If he had punished with three plus four four, he would have had a launcher. But here we go, set, not set point, game point for peeling. Cali roll, wow, he even ducked for it. Oh, gets the pickup of the firecracker. That one was close enough for the wild standing four. I found out at range you can do crowd cancel back two with Law to pick up Firecracker. Yeah. So you can just crowd cancel Junkyard. How, how tough is the crowd cancel before pulling out the Junkyard there? Oh, it's not, it's not too hard. It's oh, just okay. that it's, uh, if you do it as slow at all, it's going to win. Yeah, because you know, I feel like in the, for the most part in, 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 in Tekken, when you're doing crouch console combos, most of them are easy, but there's certain ones that are like super, super hard. What? He should have rage yard in the he back. He definitely should have rage yard in the booty. Yeah, he should have rage yard in the back. Instead, Peeling going to get that round and get game one with it. That's a bit unfortunate there, but anyways. Man. I look at him right back to switching his music. Man, Reflex, he had that one. Yeah, he had it. I don't know what happened there. A couple of things he misjudged, you know, the wall earlier, but he still got wall that no round. Wall. wall. All right, you got it, you got it. Yeah, Serio. You think you're cool, huh? Serio. Huh? All right. I was pretty confident. I felt like there was like 40 wall stages in two. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, who would have thought? 
All right, here we go. Duomo Di Sirio continuing it and appealing is up 1-0 right now. Mm -hmm. I'd say he, he played pretty comfortably that that uh, that set. Yeah, very relaxed. And if you if you need a beat peeling, that's what you got to do, right? You got to get him on edge. Yeah, you got to get in his face. You got to push his stuff in. Mm -hmm. All right, size of four. Oh wow, this is up. actually a winners qualifier match to get out of the pool and winners. Yeah, I mean these pools are they're they're breezing by. I mean we have had uh, pretty much most of the matches on stream today have been winners qualifier matches. Mm -hmm. Oh, I can't wait. After this, we have Equinox, even butt cheeks. Ooh, Equinox boy. Dimeback versus Gandito. The butt cheeks are back, boys. Yup. Counter it, size step four. Nice, oh, okay. Whoa, wow, that was, that was a nice attempt. I liked it. Dragon hammer time. Did Don't Candido shave his head from yesterday? Or was he wearing a hat? Uh, he was definitely wearing some weird mask and everything. Yeah. Did he have hair? I ate ice cream with him. I don't remember. <laughs> <laughs> I ate ice you, you did something as intimate as eating ice cream with somebody you don't even remember. All right. I, we didn't share the same cone or something, you know? Oh, you do that? <laughs> I didn't know that was an option sometimes. It wasn't sometimes. that intimate. Oh, okay. Not well, that, that point, intimate. Yeah. I've, had, I've had hotter ice cream experiences <laughs> yeah. in my time. I got you. Okay. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, try to get a hop key there. Unable to get there. I think it was a missed input. And then I'm getting the whoop. Oh, here we go, counter it. Yeah, again, man. Side step forward is putting a lot of work appealing in the set. He's just been catching hey. them. And you know what I've noticed from reflexes? Uh, he's using his reflexes. He's not randomly ducking low. So he's only, oh my god. Oh boy, the perfect. Yeah, he was able to reel that out of him. And now peeling one round away from moving on and out of these pools here. Oh, Beautiful. nice. Beautiful. That is not something he has done this whole time. He met again. The you know, yeah, you know, it's good to have wall carry combos, yeah. but you got no one not to use them. Well, that's cool. Like, maybe he does have the best wall carry combos in the game, but maybe he can't see the distance between him and the wall. I mean, I wish I knew his combos. <laughs> yeah, it was cool. I was like, man, that's so dope, but the wall messed you up. And it, it, you messed yourself up with the wall. It wasn't even like the wall messed you up. You put yourself in that position. Okay. Too far, way too far for the race drive. Nice back dash from Reflex. They're poking away. Peeling has a sliver of life oh, left. Oh, God. Oh, you went and hit a button that, that didn't hit him. I, I feel like that might be it. No, he's going to live. He's going to oh, live. Snap. Oh, that Run is it. slide. And so, peeling 2-0. to zero, Makes it out of the winner side of his pool. No Tanakana. Lucky guy. Lucky, lucky. Reflex still going to have to play another match to make it out, I believe. Yeah. He, he de Well, no. I mean, he makes it out. He still makes oh, it out because this is winner's no, finals, no, no, no. right? It's the, they take three final. out, right? I don't think it's winner's oh, finals. It's, it's winner's qualifier. qualifier. Gotcha. Yeah. I don't believe that. Well, speaking. Maybe. So we have Gandito. Right, Gandito, the ice cream sharer, going up against even butt cheeks. Is he wearing, what is that underneath? Is that a Kingdom Hearts shirt? I saw a what? crown. No, nothing. Why Gandito look so mad? Focus, man. He's got that Master Raven now. He's no longer. Oh yeah, I forgot. He's a not a Mishima player. anymore. He's so mad because Raven doesn't have a 15 frame launcher from standing. Are they getting close? Pulls for the camera together. <laughs> Dimeback has to scoot over a bit. <laughs> it's like, nah, man. You got to move over. Look, it's not lined up. Dimeback's moving the monitor. Like, you're not gonna move it. You're not gonna move over. I'm moving the monitor, then, bro. Look. What is he on, saying, bro? He's like, move over. You're hogging too much space. Damn, their headphones match their arcade sticks. How do they coordinate that? That's actually pretty weird. <laughs> <laughs> wow, the classic TE2 for Gandito. Oh, he plays on Japanese stick, huh? Yeah, uh, he's. I think he's always been on Japanese stick. He's really? never been a green stick user, yeah. Interesting. Gandito, runner-up at EVO 2008. Way back in Tekken 5 Dark Resurrection. Dimeback was, uh, how would you describe his play style earlier today against that other guy? Erratic. Erratic? And then erotic. Wow. All in the same match. <laughs> it, it changed. It like changed like in, almost instantaneously. It's so weird, man. Yeah, he was like, I feel like he was trying to show off. He was, right? Yeah, I feel like he was trying He's to show off. He's also trying to like, style also on him and also being a little a bit dick. of a douchebag. Yes. <laughs> you know? Dick back over here. 
But yeah, it was weird. It wasn't like he normally played. Because, right? you know, normally he's very calculated and... So, uh, I mean, the thing is, does he know who Gandito is? Does he know that this is a threat? Does anyone know who Gandito is? Anymore? I don't know. I, I mean, don't think so. He was a decade Gandito ago. Gandito only... The last time Gandito played in a Tekken tournament was at CEO last year. No way. Yeah. That's At least one that was part of the TWC. Dimeback. So I, I I highly doubt that Dimeback has ever had this player on his radar. Right. And for more intensive purposes, I know Gandito is the guy that gives people massages at tournaments, mm -hmm. not as a second player. He, he gives a good massage, let me tell you that. I hear he has pretty eyes, too. That's what Rick was telling me. Oh, okay. How did Rick see his eyes? Yes, he has, was yes. he standing on a chair? Yes. <laughs> he does that. I've seen him do commentary before. Wow. I thought it was just boxes. Yeah, chairs, boxes, it doesn't matter. There's definitely boxes in the chat right now. Uh-oh. Nice. Keeping that pressure at the wall here. And you know, oh, damn, he held down from the nosebleed stun already? Good stuff. Hey, hey. Reversal. All right, Gandito. You got to step it up a notch. There you go. Forward, three, plus four. Launch that. Hey, step on it. Punish? Oh, too far. Maybe Raven can punch it down back to one. Counter with the punch, that's gonna give a wall combo and a round for Dimeback. Here we go, Dimeback looking for the three straight. Wow, Toothbird just start off the round. Like, whatever, yeah. you can try something, try something, I let, dare you. Let me repair your mouth, Tooth Fairy. Uh-oh. Oh my God. Neutral jump, is that gonna kill? <laughs> Uh-oh. That was weird, why did he do up neutral three? Who knows? Yeah. Uh, maybe it was back in his stick bounce. Who knows? Okay. Gandito having a chance here, an opportunity. What if the power? Oh my gosh. Mm -mm. Oh man, is it time, Gandito? Is it time to bring out the mission was? Yeah, you definitely go not. back. Definitely not. Definitely not what? Not time to bring him out? No, I feel like his Mishima is like. I don't know if he still practices the Mishimas, but I feel like you know to be a Mishima player, you have to be all in. You got to be dedicated. Ah. Uh, I mean, maybe he's still got him. No, I doubt it. I doubt it. I believe. He doesn't even have his hair anymore. <laughs> he's like, yeah, he definitely doesn't have His hair have... was his Mishima power? Uh, no, not, not necessarily. I mean, he's losing things in life. Oh, man. He definitely doesn't have his, his wave dash anymore. I mean, obviously, we saw they went stage select. All right, Gandito is going to stick it out, Master Raven. Rack the Raven. Here's wait, 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 wait a minute. Wait Did you guys just see that? Did you? I read it. No wonder he said he has pretty eyes. <laughs> Let's go and tell the people. This just in. Gandito is here in the winner's qualifier because he beat Rickstar. He just walked over him. <laughs> That's crazy. We were talking about these guys. We didn't even know they were in the same pool. Yeah. Gandito beating Rickstar with Master Raven? Yeah, you know what? Look I... at the damage. That's crazy, actually, because Rickstar uses Master Raven, too. Yeah, that's nuts. Man, actually, SoCal's losing Master Ravens. I lost El Negro's Master Raven. Oh, the, the, hey. the bane of SoCal's existence in tournament play. Master Raven, the SoCal killer. But we'll sit here back. from SoCal. Uh, that's it. Me and me, Rick, and Tasty Steve. Okay. From NorCal, we got Shangles and Jimmy J. Yeah, Grant. Shangles was way too excited. He's always excited. That yeah. guy's cool. Super <laughs> like hype. Him. Yeah, I feel like... Uh, He's been inspired to go to more TWT events since he had that match with you at NCR. I think <laughs> that was his breakout moment. He's like, you know what? I'm going to I'm gonna go out to if every event. If he beats someone else, I'm going to pop up and run around the stage like he was. <laughs> 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 yeah, because he just got into top eight, right? Yeah. Uh-oh, here we go. Yo, Gandito. Hey, Gandito. Right <laughs> Wait, event, is that right? Man. Is it 1-0? No, Dimeback got the first game. Oh, yeah, game. Dimeback definitely got the first game. Sorry, guys. And yeah, we're updating the scores. I guess the, the the team is testing us to make sure we're paying attention. Because I wasn't. I did, I did Rick not did. <laughs> I wasn't. I had to ask. Uh oh. Hey, pop, pop. Oh, but super high wall splat. Nice. Yeah, this could do a lot of damage here. Close to 50%. It and that's really what, 50. That's what Master Raven excels in. You know, Master Yo, Raven. Back is round. Chicken oh, two. Oh, my God. Yo, I'm a tournament better. Woo! Hold this race drive. I'm Gandino. Did oh, you say, back. Did you say good shit? I don't know what he said. He's yeah. like, holy shit, my ass is on the Equinox. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. All right, this is going to be tough. This is going to be tough. I feel like Gandino has the momentum now. Dude, is that Plague right there? The yeah. Virtue Fire from yes. SoCal? What is he doing here? 
He goes to more of these events now. It's Florida. <laughs> but he goes to these events. What? You know, he, um, you know, he works in the industry doing like you know website stuff, right? Oh, I didn't know all that. No. Oh, okay. I'll tell you about it later. But cool. he, he he does the website for the Tekken World That's Tour. That's awesome. So he does the Tekken World Tour. He website. does the Tekken World Tour site. No yeah. kidding. The, the, the coding. For yeah, yeah, yeah. That's yeah. awesome. Because the, the the site this year. But much he does them for all year. the fighting game sites. Wow. Yeah. Okay. Play. Good yeah. stuff. Here we go. The final game: Gandito versus Equinox and Dimeback. Winner makes it out of the well, pool and winners. Okay, this is going to be big because I feel like, again, like I said, Gandito has the momentum right now. He has the crowd cheering for him. And poor Dimeback is scared shitless because his sponsor <laughs> and the team owner is behind him. He's like, I got to impress him. Yo! That was sick. And right now he's got rage. Dimeback can make his comeback happen though. Oh, uh, yeah, he definitely can. Oh, oh my god, god not, like, not this. like that at all. The blocks. Dimeback, what are you going to do? He makes the punch. Oh, I can't believe he hit that. Uh huh, get the. Oh my gosh. Yo, Dimeback, he knows what he's doing. That's what we always say when he messes up. <laughs> <laughs> oh Beautiful my punish. gosh. One throw, get off me. I like what I'm seeing. Oh. They're testing Gandito now. Get standing for it. Oh. Beautiful block and nice punish here from Gandito. While standing one all the way to the wall, he knew the wall. Oh my god, what the hell? Nice throw break from Dimeback. Gandito didn't get a wall combo because oh. of that. I wonder how calm that is. Oh my wow, god, I can't believe it. Oh my Beautiful. god, way. He should be able no, to the wall's oh, in the way. Oh my god. He's gonna die. He's, He's done. dead. That's cheating. That is just cheating. What that is unfortunate. A scramble at the end of that round there. And unfortunate for Gandito, man. He, I thought he had it. He could have won both of these rounds. Yeah. He should have been up 2 0 right now. Instead, Dimeback running away with the final game. And he gets the follow up here. Not just that. He's gonna push towards the wall. This is where it's really scary because Oscar. Uh -huh. Oh my god, I can't you believe the vampire low? need. I got those. Gandito. This is the follow up there with the Ford. Oh, oh my god! Crazy. Yeah. He's Korean. Oh my. Oh Got my it. gosh. Oh my god. He tried. He tried. He tried. It's not over. It's not over. He's still in the game. Gandito. I believe in him still. Nice. 2 1. Oh, nice. nice. And that might be it. That this should could be, it. be. The wall's not there. He's good. Oh, oh my. Pixel. Okay, the back one was four. <laughs> got so high. I got super high because I thought he was going to make a comeback. Man, Gandito had so many chances there. But those clutch moments in the first and second round really sealed the deal He's for He's not Dimeback. done yet, though. That was still winner. So Dimeback, of course, qualifying out of his pool. Oh, I can't wait to do, see right? this other match that we have. Wow. Oh. All right. Things so are getting interesting. We're going to have some hype. So we're going to have some hype and we're going to have something interesting. Look, you see that big boy on the screen right there? Yeah, he's coming up on stage. So get ready, everybody. Man. But he's going up against Four Wood from Texas. And Four Wood, oh, I don't know if he's NorCal or Texas. I know he moved back and forth. Yo, Big Boy's arms like Hulk Hogan's bicep size. What is that, 27 inch python? 44 inch. Damn! But those, really? two, those two guys you see on the screen in the middle there, they're going to be playing each other. Uh -huh. And Four Wood recently got second place at uh, a DreamHack event where he got second to Sweet Kicks. He is an Akuma player. Mm -hmm. Probably, I would say, him and Rick Star are the best Akuma players in the US. Yeah, he. What? <laughs> Who told me this? I think it was Fab last night. Yeah. He said the difference between them is that... Uh, well, well, Rix is a second player. Four Wood is not. He came from the Street Fighter scene. That's exactly what I said. And Rix said, that's not what it's about. Rix has said, it's just because he has better execution than me. I'm like, because he has more <laughs> Street Fighter experience than you? I don't understand. Well, yeah, I mean, because of because of him being such a... He's an Akuma player in Street Fighter. So. Right, and here's the thing. In Street Fighter V, uh, Four Wood, he played that game. Yeah. Didn't like it. And so he just switched over to tech and, and used the Kuma full time. He's like, you know what? They put one of my characters in this game. Let me try this out. Yeah. Oh, damn. Big boy. Oh. Adjusting the sleeves. Yeah. Hiding the biceps. Putting yeah. them away. He doesn't want to put the hurt on nobody. That big boy. Super solid tech player. Is he from ATL? Or is he from... Uh... Big boy? Yeah. Yeah, he's ATL. He is, right? Yeah. I mean, when you I... hear someone loud and it's not poke chop, they're from <laughs> ATL. <laughs> I was talking to Forward earlier. I mean, you can see he's got a bunch of gray hair, right? Yeah. How old do you think that man is? 20. <laughs> a nice Come feel. On. No, I, I feel like he's under pressure. He's 30. Uh, is he? Even. Oh. Are you, is that confirmed? Confirmation okay. on your screen. Damn, we look good for our age, Ed. Right? Uh -huh. I'm feeling good about this. Actually, a lot of people don't know this because I always wear hats. I have I have nice hair. Mark's hair is ridiculous. They don't know about that. For those of you guys that don't know, I mean, it's I cannot believe how fast your hair grows. Well, you know why I don't show off my hair is because I don't want to make Eris feel bad. <laughs> why don't you just like donate him a wig? 
You could grow totally. it out in like a month. Well, what if what if he starts like ends up starts looking like me? I don't want to mess up his <laughs> lifestyle. Like, our DNA is me mesh, and then all of a sudden yeah. he loses his beard. You could give him a hair transplant. If if he wants that, I'll give him some of my there hair. There you go. You know there what, Eris? I will. <laughs> That's the ultimate sacrifice. I will help you graduate from the BGC. <laughs> But I mean, if he doesn't want it, if he doesn't want the hair on my hand, I could give him the hair from somewhere else. Was that infiltration and did what? that? Oh, yeah. Uh, I don't, I don't know for sure, but I think so. What are they playing with? I don't oh, know. Are they playing Fire Pro? Probably, right? Oh yeah, it's got to be because it's, it's both the NJPW guys. Ibushi has some sick ass sneakers on. It. Oh damn! Those are, are really you expensive. Tell me. Those are really expensive sneakers. Are they Nike? They're uh, Supreme. Uh, what? Air more of tempos. Oh snap! All right, we're starting this match. Enough of this distraction. Yeah, we, I mean, I wish they could see what we were looking at right now. This is amazing. Yeah, actually, I want to. Here, you handle that. I'm out of here. What? <laughs> I'm hey, going to take some pictures. Hey. Yeah, actually, you should definitely do that. Actually, That's pretty cool. I can handle it for a second. It's cool. Forward nah, versus I'm a professional. Big boy. We'll have Hanzo take the picture for us. Hanzo, get a picture for us of that. Especially the shoes. Can you take a picture of them playing, but get their full bodies in there? Uh, fuck that. All right, he doesn't want to get in trouble. Wow, Hanzo. All right, all right, all right. <laughs> <laughs> Hans, just run over here and we'll protect you. The one time he fears for his life I can't from physical a abuse. Never heard this from Hans. No, though. it's okay. My goodness. It's okay. We, go. we need 10 guys. <laughs> then we'll go there. Anyways. Uh, uh, actually, All right, Hans is going to do it. Hey, wait, can you put it on my Instagram, Hanzo? <laughs> Anyways, Forward Wood starting it off. But Big Boy using Claudio right now. I like what I'm seeing. He's doing it so far. <laughs> He's like 40 <laughs> feet away taking a photo of Kenny and Bushi playing. Oh my god. I love Zoom you, Hanzo. In. You're the best. I take a picture. You got this, Hanzo. Oh yeah, forward off to a great start. <laughs> this is the funniest. I think I feel like I should be recording. But anyways, into the matchup again. Big boy. And this time with the combo, getting the knee follow-up, and he now in Starburst. Hanzo definitely is taking <laughs> selfies of himself on my phone. Hanzo, give me that back. He's uploading it to your Instagram. <laughs> this is the best exception, you guys. Make sure you guys check out. <laughs> you definitely posted that. Oh my God. You copped this, Mark. Yeah, I got it. Don't worry about it. Delete your evidence. Anyways, good block, great punish here. Gets the ball standing 4 forward. Oh, they traded blows, but not enough life there for Akuma. Tied up on rounds, one round apiece. Oh, look at that. All right, the follow-up here. And look at the patience here from 4 Wood. Mm -hmm. He's still trying to find his bounce wow. here, but he now has meter. This is where he becomes dangerous. Oh, he had an opportunity. Get. Oh, he didn't do the demon <laughs> flip. Uh, we were talking about execution, right? <laughs> yeah. He's the execution man. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my oh, God. Oh, no, he's dropping combos, man. He had a down for 2 could have been down for 2 one That should be the round, though. Yep. I like it, though. Able to burn it out, take the round. The round more important than getting the stylish combo. All right, now what? Here we go. Still look at, look at these. We're trying to find that space in there, trying to find that opening. Big Boy just very content with just sidestepping and waiting for that opportunity. Get off me. Uh oh. Has another chance. Puts the brakes on, goes for the low jab. Oh. Nice. Confirmation. 4 3. No. Yes, gets it. Now, what are you going to do, though? Okay. Yeah, trying to get the maximum. Oh, he caught him out of the air. That should be it. That might no. be it. Sidewall stun. Doesn't Again. matter. Gets the mid. Was that the mid? Yeah, down four mm -hmm. two. Very nice. Forward. You know what happened, Big Boy. Don't act like you're thinking about the matchup. What is Big Boy's other character? It wasn't Claudio before. It was Lars. Lars? But he had something else, too. Was it Asuka? I don't know if he had an Asuka. Bob? I think it was Bob. What? Man, Does he what also have he a doing? Master Raven? He's all over the place. Look, look what this guy posted on my Instagram story. Look, look at this. That's what I also posted on my Instagram story. I'm going to leave it there so people can enjoy that face of... They should. Oh, my God. Actually, what a make sure you guys check out Rip on uh, Instagram. Instagram.com uh -huh. level up your game. That's the one. You guys will be treated with a, a wonderful treat. Yeah. Only on mobile, though. You can't... Well, actually, you can see it you on... You can see it on the website. You can see it on the website. Now. I forgot about that. Yeah, and my, my account's private, but... Just for Tech World Tour days, I'll approve everyone. Boom! boom. Slide into his DM, send him those pictures that he doesn't want to see. Show him your I arcade stick. I get a stick. lot of those now. It's pretty crazy. Oh, really? Yeah, a lot of dudes are out there <laughs> having well, a good time. At least time. we get something. <laughs> <laughs> Sad days. Sad All right, boys. here we go. Big boy going to the bomb. 
Yo, four wood. I feel like four wood's done. I'm impressed with no, that. No, I, I honestly dude. feel like four wood is done. Why? Because he didn't play second six. Nah, he's got this, man. No, no, no. If Big Boy is realizes that he doesn't know how to fight against Bob Strings, it's completely over. Okay, could be. But he's fighting an uppercut through them. He's a Kuma. He can, he can, but there are certain ones that he can't. Yeah, he won't know. You're right. Oh, boy. Yeah, he doesn't know what's happening. Oh, wait a second. Okay, he knows he, that. I mean, there's a block stagger. And, and here's the thing. You know, Akuma hurts so bad, they doesn't matter. He's about to build meter with this, too. Oh, oh my gosh. gosh. How did that go over him? He got him, though. Doesn't matter. While standing 2-1, big boy, first round. Big boy. Eight. All right, first round here. I'm telling you, man, he's going to have to test him. If he starts using the back two or the down two string, it's going to be all over. I highly doubt that Four Wood has that in his experience bucket. Oh, for sure, yeah. And, you know, you definitely... Uh, I, oh my, what? Down for the floor. The fact that the way that he's fighting him right now, he definitely does. Oh my gosh, this is gonna hurt. <laughs> Never mind. The execution. Ex execution guy. What? He still gets the float. The hop kick out of the air for Akuma. Yeah, yeah exactly. he doesn't know exactly. It. He there ducked out the third hit, is not available. You called it 100% correct. Yeah, so I feel like Four Root's gonna have to change his gameplay. He's gonna have to go strict, strictly for offense. He cannot rely on his defense in this matchup. And he's but, trying now. FADC combos. Wall pressure. Oh my know. god, how did that hit? Yeah, this I, is. I didn't even think that was counter hit. This is looking like a great adaptation by Big Boy here. This is with the bot pick, but Four would not out of it just yet. Akuma, so much damage. He's gonna have a meter to work with. If Four can land the combos here. Oh boy, beautiful whip for the standing too. Oh yeah, he's gonna get the wall here as well. And what is he gonna do to break it? No, he tried. Slumped too, too far. Oh, wow, oh instant gosh. while standing too, and look at that. I Ooh. dropped it! Dude, he, that was weird. He didn't get the dash. Oh, got the full charge. And the range drive into Does the mix-up. Oh, he went for the mid. He just stood. I would have went for the low. Oh, we got him. Here we go. Set point for forward. I feel like Big Boy is going to have to pull out all the stops. He's going to have to start going in. Damn, to Baylor, they're like, Timmy! Timmy! This the wall, is no. too intense for me. Oh man, here we go. Down three tosses. Four with bringing it back. Nice jab. Gets him out of the air. Break the wall? No. Just get the wall combo. Keep the pressure on. Big boy's got it back up. Oh, he got caught. Tried to power crush. Akuma no down three. Break the power crush. Here comes the combo. Ragey for big boy. Last chance. He's Ragey. Oh my god, is that gonna be enough? Is it gonna kill? Probably I not. I don't know. I don't think it is though. Oh, oh my, my god. god, it did a lot though. Hit the ah! button! Big Boy survives with the Tekken 6 Classic! Jeez, I can't believe it! The down one! The down one! All right, we're going to a final match then. Man, that was what a crazy ending. The Rage Art to bring it all the way back, and then the down one slow-mo? Yeah, and now we are in the Arctic Snowfall. No walls here, it's coming down to this. Man, these guys, you usually big boys a lot more hype than this. He's chill. Where's his I mean, boys at? That's all I was just going to ask. Where are all the boys at? I mean, maybe Poke Chop got sent to loser bracket. Let's hear it for maybe the they're boys. all uh, deflated right now. All right, here we go. Starting it off for Wood. I think the longer or the more time he has uh, to play in this matchup, the better off he'll be. Definitely. But no walls now, so Akuma damage is going to be a little bit reduced. Wait, what? Yo, Tasty Steve made it out of pools. Let's go. Final game. That Four means I'm doing commentary boy. by myself. Yeah. yeah. Sorry, Mark. It's all good. I got Michael Murray. He's my backup. Nam Cops got my back. Damn. Mr. All Cops? Mr. All Cops. That's going to be your new <laughs> That's name, a good bro. one. <laughs> what are you doing, big boy? You guys do like, something, man. He's like trying to turtle when he's down by 99%. I know. That's, uh, that's the best part. He's like, I'm sure they'll make a mistake any moment now. Then I'll hit him with my 100% combo. Hey, hey. Okay, adjustment here. Goes for the power crush. Oh, he caught him. Yeah, you're definitely right. The longer the set has gone on, forward has definitely gotten stronger and stronger. Double down jab, converts to toss. It doesn't spend any meter behind it. Doesn't need to. The perfect. And that's the thing, you know, Four Wood is not afraid. Now he's going in offensively, and Big mm -hmm. Boy, for some reason, still playing with that defensive mindset. Counter hit there, double jab into the follow up. You know, he's really lucky. Ooh, oh my boy. God. How did that happen? But that hit, that did a lot of damage. Hey, but Billy, train, pick it up. He had an opportunity there, not able to capitalize. And this might be Big Boy's last stand. 
He's down. having to deal with the plasma right now. That'd be crazy if Bob could like roll forward through the fireball. Oh yeah. boy, forward drop pick combo. Opportunity, last chance, big boy. What do you got? Nothing. Oh. Oh. To the demon flip, grab, and four Wu takes it. Big boy down to the loser's bracket. Man, that's some stuff right there. That was impressive. Forward, you know, had to adapt. Definitely did not have the Bob experience, but he yep. really pulled it back together and sends uh, a tournament Tekken veteran to the loser bracket. Yeah, so good stuff, of course, to both of these players. We'll be seeing both of them, I'm sure, later on today. Well, if, if Big Boy makes it out again, but yeah. Forward will be coming back. And again, oh, we guys, we want to thank you for tuning in. There's been a lot of Tekken action so far today, but I believe we are going to be taking a short break. Am mm -hmm. I right? We we swap around some commentators, I believe. Yeah, and uh, you've been on here for a minute. Congratulations! I heard you made, like you said, you made it out of pools. Taste Steve also made it out of pools. So we'll be back, of course, with more Tekken later. I hope you guys lose early so you can be back on the commentary desk with me. But we'll be back in just a bit. Peace out. Let us. So there are some mirror matches that are are really whack and boring.